Okay, hi everyone, welcome back. So in today's video, we're gonna be unboxing these barrels here. I'm gonna try and do it as quick as possible because it's getting dark and it's only me alone doing this. I know maybe you guys wanna see like some stuff that I ship down and honestly, just a little bit of stuff from like my apartment and stuff. If you guys are wondering where I got this outfit from, I got it downtown Kingston, Jamaica. I actually have a whole entire haul on my channel of me like hauling like fashion pieces that I bought downtown. So this was only a I, would, I think I pay less than a thousand dollars, but the most for this set would be a thousand dollars downtown. Yeah, so that's all the details. So let's go into these barrels. I have three barrels, but there's a lot packed into it because we pack some stuff in there. I can't find. Okay, we have a whole bin of. Oh, by the way, I'm at my mom's house. I live in an apartment, so I didn't want to bring these there. Number one, people are fast in Jamaica. Number two, no one's trying to bring these up any stairs. Like nobody at all. Nobody. Not even me. So I was like, let me leave these here and I'll unbox them here and then just put them in like bags. These are the bags I'm going to be using. Carcass bugs. <laughs> because we have a huge bin of reusable bags, but I do not know where the bin is. It was in the laundry room. I went in the laundry room. I haven't been here for a while, so I went in the laundry room. It's not there. My mom's like, it's in the shed, but I don't know where the shed key is. But if I find the shed key throughout this video, I'll get it. So I'm going to try and pack as much as I can in these bags. Let me show you guys. All of these. I don't really care. And then if I go in the kitchen and I find like some reusable bags, I'll use that too. I'm going to try to find the shed key so I can get out more bags but yeah let's get into this also i have my water bottle here so when i'm going through these yeah everything is like good i need a knife i need a knife okay i'm testing the lighting oh i had zip ties on these but they uh, took them off i don't know if they still took them off but My projector game. some things I can't really get dirty certain things can get dirty but some oh like this this is actually not even for this is for my niece and nephew I bought this for them I have like um sheets for my bed okay so that can go on the ground here go in here like I have um that was supposed to be for a collab that was in a set of they have printing paper a bleach powder and I was like the roosters are trying to bite me up got food in here um, I got more food. Got more cereal. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna bring this with me. Menso club that I have in Jamaica. I got some more food. In America at Dollar Tree, when I was there, they were selling five packs of these for one dollar. Or was it six? I don't remember. But if you live in America, you're talking about. So I picked up like so many packs. I don't really eat it like that. Some for other people. Oreos, and they're not broken out. I'm feeling them right now. Because I like having it with. More milk, so that's why more. Um, yes, conditioner, Tresemme, of course. More food. Okay, when you see stuff like this, these things use like down here, like this card. It's just bowls. And they didn't crack at all. So yeah. Okay, so I got this. We put like some sauce. These were like eighty cents or twenty-five cents, something cheap. So I picked cases and then some nail. I was looking for this nail glue with that, like foods. This is my washcloth. This in Canada was winners, but if I remember, it was like um, TJ Matt. Oh my god, I got this cool kettle from I. Let me show you guys it actually, and then put it on the stove like this. It won't crack or anything. I like it's really cool. This is a glass cup. Oh my gosh, curtains came. This is for my beauty room. My curtains. I've been waiting for these. I got. I brought a in toilet paper because they were on sale. Yeah, and the basket's full of. Stuff. Basket is full of so like um, kitchen items. So I had aluminum foil for when I'm baking. So I have these two bins here, like that. Carry it. I can some bed sheet. Great. What is this? Oh, my projector. I'm gonna put the projector of the crocus. This probably like um soap. Yeah, I brought down like a. I bought that. I bought it in America. They're like super cheap. No, dogs are trying to. Oh, can anyone guess what it is it's rice the amount of bags of rice that we have i'm gonna have enough bags of rice i thank you at least i'm moving faster i got more curtains i'm gonna have to stand on something and go in here okay the mega mart bag actually i hope there's nothing in here one of these mega mart bags had like all this like flour in it and i was like what the okay no let me see. just shake the bags guys it's unbelievable okay so i'm gonna put these and the rest of the it'll be like that all the like delicates i'll put in this bag here 
I'm just gonna step on it. Hopefully I don't fall and bust up myself. Oh my god, there's something something heavy at the bottom. Let me show you guys. It's wrong with the first barrel. This is not too bad. Okay, I'm gonna have to just turn this on the side. No no this. I don't think I It looks really chaka chaka right now, but see that's all stush. It looks chaka chaka. <laughs> right now. Chaka chaka. Let me show you guys what I got more paper towels. This like all came at the right time. And then more things for my niece and nephews. If you guys are wondering what happened to my you guys I got cut by zinc because I didn't clean it. But this was telling you guys it's microwaves. And if I didn't see this, I they sent in it was like only forty dollars. Something cheap like that. And I was like, okay, let me just buy this. They smell it. It's food, guys. That's that was at the bottom of this barrel. Sorry, I didn't even get to show you guys this correctly. Inside here, there's like all the snacks. All my Twinkies and my half a moon. Let me show you there's more chips in here. Chips, chips, chips. Snacks for days. <laughs> I love it over here. Okay, the camera's gonna die, so I'm gonna switch to my vlog camera. Oh, yeah, more one. And then I got some. I think I shipped down like this. Buy rice. I don't have to buy rice. First one down, two more to go. So these are my cart mats at the side. That's it. So this is it. This is the first one down. This barrel here, this one is extremely heavy. I don't know what's in it. I know I have some, I think I have some cam, like YouTube tech stuff. I don't know, but so this one's done. Let me go dash this. Ugh. Wait, my car's not in the background, is it? <coughs> We're done with that one. Let's do the light one. I think there's a little bit in it. I kind of wish I packed more food. Like more like snacks and stuff. <coughs> not gonna lie. So if you guys are watching this and want to pack a barrel, pack a lot of food. Oh shoot, I forgot about this. <laughs> this is still recording. Guys, if you're liking this video so far, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Share it to someone that you guys think might like it. And comment down below something that you like packing or bringing to Jamaica. Or sending down in a barrel to Jamaica. How about that? Here's some clothes. Oh, my bag is wrapped. One of my purses. Oh wow, that's so funny. And inside the purse, I, we pack some food in it. Cute. So we're just gonna put this back up. This is like in a shirt that we're gonna give away to someone. Yo, these crocross bugs for the wind. Nama! This is a little bit too dirty in here. Why does it sound like curry in here? It's okay, it's clothes. We can wash the clothes. Okay, got some more stuff. Like these are for all things that. Oh my god, these are my glass cups. Oh, these are all del delicates. Oh my gosh. I have some wine cups that I... Let me show it to you guys, actually. I'm so excited. This was wrapped good. See how we wrapped it in a big, huge, thick sweater? And then in the big sweater, we have it in another shirt. <gasps> and then we wrapped the stem with more clothing. Look at this. I'm so excited. Look at that. Pretty. This is going with my... um. This is going with my tissue papers and toilet paper, so I know that I opened it. Okay, we have toilet paper. Now, um, when I was in Canada, they had a pack of 24 for like $10. And these are like the good quality, I think it was like Charmin or something, so I picked up two packs. So I picked up 20 and 20 is 40. I got 48, so I'm not gonna be going to the supermarket for a while. Even though like uh, toilet paper is cheap down here too. Um, well, depends what kind you get. I like buying the good quality ones. I don't really care. I don't really watch the price. Oh, I have it right here. See, I left it in here. The Royal, yeah, this brand. The Royal. So this is the Ultra Plush toilet paper. It's good quality. I think my sister is the one who sent this to me. One of my sisters. She's like, yo, twin. <laughs> this is the deal. Well, when I go to my house, I'll store them in here. Or you guys with me. <gasps> my pot came. This pot is really cute and small. And then inside of it, we, we put some stuff in it. Cute. Yeah, like most of these stuff are like glass. 
Oh, I got some more bowls. And I think there's food in here too. Now we just package this just like this. It's like chips and, oh, bathroom stuff. So, and I'm gonna use this basket in the bathroom. You guys will see what I do with it. We're doing good so far. Another pot. I wanted some more pots. And every single one of the pots them, we always put stuff in it. Let me see if I can show you guys. I'll show you guys another pot, but inside of this pot, there's like things inside of it. Ooh, we have shampoo. Champagne glasses. No, this is a oh, this is a vase for my. I sorry, that was my champagne glasses. But I have some cute like green plant plants. I'm gonna put in here. Excited for that. I've been actually waiting for this barrel so I can do some home stuff for you guys on my channel. And then I got another one of these. I love these a lot. Um, when I make my juices, the jugs, it just looks cute. See through. It looks pretty. I like it. Oh my god, there's so much glass in here. That's why it's so like light. I don't want any of these to break because I would cry. I got these for my pantry for my certain snacks and stuff. So you guys will see for my kitchen tour. We got so much more toilet paper, of course, like so much. Oh gosh, I can't make this fall. If this falls, I'm doing it. Why do we have so much Mega Mart bags? Wait, is this the one that was the flower was in it? I don't know. My sister went to Mega Mart and then, no, I don't want to use that for my toilet paper. Oh, this bag is good. The meat bag from like um, the meat store in Spallings. Whatever. Yeah, this is super clean. I love this bag, it's really nice. So we use this. We'll put the rest of the toilet papers in here. Oh my God, there's so much. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's so much and it's not even done yet. Nah, man, I don't have to buy toilet paper for months. Maybe the rest of the year actually, because it's only me alone living. Filled to the brim. Oh my God, my ring light is here. My brand new updated ring light, more pot. My ring light, I'm pretty sure I put stuff in here too. Look at the toilet paper did. Yep. I have food in here. Wait, I had a smaller ring light too. I don't even know. Okay, these are, I can tell these are plates. Yeah. I don't know what the bee cloud I'm doing with so much plates. Like, only God knows. I just had Dollar Tree, I remember, in America when I was there in the summer. This is why it's like good and bad to shop like before you move in. Because sometimes when you shop before you move in, you buy way too much stuff. And then when you shop after, you'll buy like as much as you need, right? It's like a pro and con. This broke. This is for actually for my microwave. Do you know I'd like to spin it around? I'm gonna have to use my glue and put it back together. Thank God it was only broken right here. Gosh, let me put this somewhere good. Okay, so I got these um flutes, these champagne flutes. I saw them at TJ Maxx and I could not let them go. They are only $6.99. Let me show you guys. Let me come closer for the girls. So TJ Maxx. And then this is like a haul. Did we sign up for this? No, we did not, Hansi. And the way I wrapped it, it's still, thank you God, intact. Party at my house. Yo, it looks like it's going to rain so bad. Oh my gosh. My crocus bag with the glass fell. These pants I don't care about. Nah, this is hard work still. I'm scared to go into the heavier barrel. Like, what did we pack in there? Okay, this is my car cover. So excited to have it. And then I have some feminine hygiene products in here. My car cover, Um, I wanted to put in my suitcase, but this was big. I bought this at Canadian Tire. I don't know. I wanted a waterproof one, but this is not even waterproof. So I don't know how this is going to go. But look how big it is, guys. Like, it's huge. What's in there? Then I have more glass stuff. I can feel it. This is for, like, my sugars and stuff. Fill it with sugar. Put the lid on it. Look how cute in my kitchen. When I tell you guys to utilize every local space, utilize it. And every jug that you use. Yeah, this is around. You guys will see like a lot of like boy clothes. Like it's just to give away. Yeah. Another for like sugar or salt or something. Or like oats. Yeah. <laughs> plates again. Like, come on now. This is for like smaller things though. So I need these plates here. I got these at IKEA. I think this is another jar. 
more jars. It's like for my organization, if anyone's wondering what I'm doing with so much jars, like organization in your kitchen. <gasps> my printer's finally here. You guys don't understand how much I've been wanting this printer for my office. I have one here already, but this one is like smaller and sleeker. Just carry it. I'm so excited for this actually. You guys don't even understand. So I got these cups. It's like a pack of, I don't even know, but they're from Ikea. I think they're like a pack of like, so it's a pack of like, I don't know, but they're from Ikea too. Sorry, my car is like in the background because I'm packing things into my car. I feel food in here. Yeah. Stuff. It seems like there's like mainly kitchen stuff in here. Okay, this is for my ring light to hold it up. Oh my God, this is the base for my car. This is so funny. And then this is actually for my car too. This is just like emergency blanket in case anything. I brought it down for my car. Oh no, this broke. <gasps> okay, hold on. I'm gonna show you guys. Okay, just more jugs and glasses wrapped up in here. Okay, hold on. <gasps> Do you know what I'm excited for? Nah, I've been, I forgot I even bought this. These are like the floor lamps from Ikea. They're very nice, like in your house. They give so much mood and they just look good. And then I always bring down like the boxes for things because I like when I have them in my house and they're in the correct boxes. So you guys can break down your boxes and put them in the barrel. If you want to put back the products in the boxes, I do that. Stay subscribed to my channel, watch my vlogs if you guys want to see like how I set up like all of this stuff in my place. We're just gonna Walmart bag. Guys, we have so many reusable bags, it's not even funny. Oh my gosh, I feel like drizzles. Like rain drizzles. Yeah, these are definitely cups. Oh no, my bin broke. Oh, it's okay. It was, I literally wanted this bin for the thing inside of it. You get these at Walmart. Some of you guys may already know about this, but it's like a bin and it comes with like 15 different other bins, but the lid broke. This is what I was showing you guys, but my battery died. So I was saying that it, the lid broke, but um, everything else is okay on the inside. Like it's just like bins. And when I cook, I want to be able to put stuff in plastic bins. And here's the bottom of the barrel. But I think this glass thing broke. Listen. You guys hear that? Something broke in there. And then this is, right? Well, six of them could be broken, or maybe just one. So this is what I was talking about. They come in a box like this from Ikea. And I was like, what am I doing with six? It's only me and probably like a few people. And I only live in an apartment. It's not like I have my house yet, which I'm gonna have soon. But this is why we wrap, because when you put it in a box like this, the mushroom. So you guys can't pack like this. You cannot. No, I think only one made it out alive. Grass cut. Well, I don't need all of them. So this is how they look. We have one made it. Let's see if this one made it. Two made it. The rest are all broken. Wait, wait, wait. Three made it. Yeah, this is why you guys wrap them. Four made it. Okay, perfect. So four made it and two are broken. So it's just these. Okay, it was nice while it lasted. At least I got four out of the six. But yeah, this is why you guys need to pack delicates. I know people are like, oh, I always bring my delicates on the plane. I don't really have space. If I could have brought those mirrors with me on the plane, I would have, but I think they were just too big. I don't know, I should, probably could have. But yeah, I love these. Does a mosquito bite me? I'm just using another reusable bag to push these in. This is gonna be at the front. More toilet paper, guys. Can you guys tell the difference between like my camera quality and my vlog camera quality? Yeah. So, this is like um, wax paper for when I'm baking. And this is my curtains. I'm so excited. Welcome to life living down here. You have to ship like almost everything. <laughs> Stop. Toilet paper. Dang, another full bag. Oh my gosh, and there's still more in this bag. It's so full already. Oh, now I know why it's so heavy in here. Now I remember, there's like... There's detergent and stuff in here. So we'll just get this one and I'll pack everything that's in like these. Bags. This is for my projector. This is the test water. Well, the water here. I'm gonna leave this here actually. That's just to test the water here. We have like a stream in our backyard. The water is so clear and nice and you can drink it. This is, what is this, cornmeal? Cornmeal. Baking stuff, just the local baking. Easy bake some more feminine hygiene guys I decided to try um the brand what is this called well this brand here 
I saw it when I was at Walmart. I'm like, let me try it out. I like trying out different, different like feminine hygiene brands to see which one I like. Running cookies for when you're extra hungry or when you have your tea. Got this foam straight there. This is for my kitchen to rest my spoons on. I love it. Where did I get this? I got this from Kitchen Plus and Kitchen Stuff and Plus or Kitchen Plus and More in in Canada. I'll put the correct name on the screen. Ugh, more of my favorite uh, makeup remover wipes. Okay, so I got this from a company and this is what smells really good. So these are Eco Strip laundry detergents and you can have like 32 loads out of each of one of these. So I'm going to try them out. Guys, I shipped this out from Canada but I left America and I like packed my suitcase with like a lot of stuff that I bought because I didn't have like enough things to pack a barrel but I had enough things to put in like two suitcases. So I just brought them to America and then I was like, okay, I'm just going to ship them from Canada. Oh, hello. Did you have your children? The dog from next door came. Oh, I think she did have her children, her doggies, her puppies. And again, I bought a lot of um, soap. Yeah, them. They went back to firing. Oh, I didn't even show you guys. I just threw it in to like chocolate. Okay, got this for one of my bathrooms. It's a toilet brush cleaner. Whisking for my bathroom. Got these for like backup food in case the world decides. Got some more of them. Okay, this. Got some more toothbrush, two pieces. Yeah. Now we pack this girl. Okay, so more conditioner. Ah. This is salt. I don't know why. Oh, from America. I was like, why would I buy salt? The salt in America was like 50 cents. And I was like, let me just pick up one little pack. Even though like literally salt, you can buy that down here. Oh, peanut butter. This is actually not for me. Honey roast creamy peanut butter. Yeah, this is not for me. Some more detergent. More detergent. Save the earth. It says, save the earth, go green. Which is right. Some more syrup for my ice cream. Shampoo. Okay, I got some more. I don't know why I bought this. Because I don't like this. I love the method sprays. I just don't like it. More of these. More lotions. I always buy Jergens. It's just really good. This is for my toilet paper roll. I don't know where the other part is. But it should be in here. Our kitchen supplies, kitchen. I got these from Bed Bath and no, yeah, Bed Bath and Beyond. I got these from. They were like so affordable. I got some candles for like when light's gone. Then I got this with it to light candles. I got a pump because we only always need a pump for like the boats and stuff. So I'm gonna leave this here too. I bought some. I bought this to try it out. This is a toilet bowl cleaner. So. And then I have an air for breathe. Guys, I have everything, all things for the home. This, I think my mom bought this for me. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my mom bought this for me because I didn't buy this. So this is supposed to like, um, she was saying that there's like an alternative that she was looking for to give me. It like helps with your room, like neutralizes it, takes up all the, like the moisture in your room so there's like no mold or anything. Oh yeah, this is the bottom of the toilet paper roll. Not the toilet paper, the paper towel holder. This is for shish kebabs or we're gonna use the jerk chicken pan. Use these. I have so many of these. Toothbrush for my guests. I bought these for my hair install. Salad dressings. More peanut butter. Oh, I got some like juices. This is funny, but I brought some. <laughs> Yay, my multivitamins. Um, sunscreen. Honestly, I don't really use sunscreen, guys. I just got it for guests that come over. Firing. Bought this to try out this brand. And chocolate, I love these so much. Ah! Dressing and dip. So Caesar dressing and dip. And then I totally forgot that I bought a lot of these actually. And then more salad dressing. This is for uh, my kitchen and my laundry room window. This is my vacuum. Hello. We literally fit a vacuum inside the barrel. Barrel come. My hot dogs, I really like hot dogs. Guys. I like condiments. I like a lot of condiments on my hot dogs. Lot of mercy. Faster. Got some more. I got like spicy mayo. I don't like. I think some. I learned the other day you can put smoothies in peanut butter. So black pepper. Got some stuff for spaghetti tin food. The reason why I got all my tin food strategic. This is chipotle dressing. Is because I know that I'm going to be using it for certain things. Some more. Bath and Body Works stuff, more seasoning, 
tuna. I love tuna. Corn. I love corn with my bully beef. So I got those. More seasoning for my meats. This is for my baking. I'll never run out of mayonnaise. <laughs> I got a big thing of um, Vaseline. Okay, this is full. Oh my gosh. More rice. For one guy. Guys, detergent. <laughs> to wash all my clothes. In here, I didn't even show you guys. I totally forgot. So we taped this because in here we put some stuff in here. We put clothes and then tin food. <laughs> some more stuff. Right? Oh, oil! Okay, I got some Kalamaya lotion. I forgot that I even shipped out oil. More oil. This is done. More. This is um, rice. Sorry, I wanted to... I'm just going to pop in quickly. I wanted to show you guys all the bags. Sorry, this bag is covering, but... Oh, the bags here. There's so much for me to go through, guys. I just showed you, like, a snippet of all the things that I got. Yeah, so here it is. So, you guys, stay tuned to my vlogs to see me unpack and all of my room makeovers. Let them begin now. This was a lot. Of, this was fun to do, show you guys some things that I got. I hope you guys like this video. Share it. Comment down below what your favorite thing is to get. I told you guys, comment down below what you guys like bringing down to Jamaica. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.